Yes, I think most people operate the strongest when they are thinking about something happy, and this was proven through tons of things. So I don't really need to go there, but um, people can actually withstand pain longer if they're thinking about sex. That's that's one instance. There's studies on that. So anyway, you can write down that here. And Robert had this really great thing to make you go up and around. I was like, how am I going to make it do this? And then Robert comes out of the back room like, hey, <laughs> you think this will work? And it was perfect. So it was it was amazing. Um, so, so that's the happy place. So you can type everything down on there, and we'll just keep going. And you can look at other people's happy places, and you can use it as your own if it makes you happy doing it. And finally, we have the exit interview. And this is where you can kind of gather your thoughts. Um, this is after, of course, you do the sound lodge, which is a playoff of a sweat lodge, um, where you can purify yourself with sound. Essentially, it's just a dark and closed space where you're just given a drone piece and you're able to let your thoughts wander. So, um, and after that, after you get out of the dungeon, you can come over here and unload. So, um, at each station, you're only allowed to do it once. Um, so there's no changing, like, oh, I don't like my key identification tag. Can I get yours? There's none of that going on here. Um, <laughs> so I hope you all um, get something out of that and, and really reflect um, at each station. Uh, so now I'm going to do a reading. Um, I got these cupcake toppers at the paper factory across the street. They're 12 cents a piece, and they're so hilarious and amazing. Um, all right, so let's get back over here.